Hello and welcome to this edition of Fi TV. I'm your host, Brad Swanson. We are coming to you just a few blocks from Florida's capital. Once again, we are in the midst of the Florida Legislative Black Caucus Scholarship Gala, and I'm joined today by Representative Camille Brown, who is Vice Chair of the caucus this year. Representative Brown, thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me, Brad. Well, I tell you what, it's always a pleasure for Fi TV to be able to cover and interview so many of the supporting legislators at the event. Um, this year it's going to be a little different. You guys are, are, are how, how is it going to be different this year? Well, this year, uh, you know, we're doing it virtual. Typically, it's a huge dance party. It's a great time to fellowship and give away scholarships to many of our students in the surrounding community, in the surrounding community, as well as the colleges here in our state. Uh, and so this year, just due to the pandemic, we figured we'll be safe and we'll do it virtually this yeah, year. That's gonna, that, that, well, the nice thing is, is everyone who can't make it up will be able to participate across the states. Absolutely. So that'll be cool. All right, so, so let's talk about these scholarships. You know, I've had the pleasure, thanks to, to you and, and previous chairs who have invited us to participate of meeting some of these, these young students that are, that are there. T tell me about the scholarships. Who do they go to? Are, are they just at FAMU and FSU or are they across the state? Well, uh, each year we do it a little different. And uh, last year we had the opportunity to have interns that were interning from the colleges of TCC, mm -hmm. the Florida State University, as well as Florida A&M University. And they were recipients, of, it was current students who were in need of financial support mm -hmm. in order to continue their education. Okay. This year, due to, uh, again, the pandemic, we're unable to have uh, the internship process or the application process. So many of these students that will be receiving these scholarships will be right from our districts, our very oh, own wonderful. districts. So yeah. Okay. Well, that's neat. So, so it truly will be statewide this year. Absolutely. Amen. Absolutely. And again, uh, there's, there's uh, just the need for uh, financial support sure. and just with wanting to go to college. So it's not a particular college that you have right. to go to, uh, just as long as you're continuing your education. Well, uh, well we love that at Phi TV. We're going to continue to uh, support the, the, the gala in any way we Absolutely. can. Thank and, you so and we're, much. We're grateful that you came on the show to tell us a little bit about it. And I'm sure you've got a lot of bills you need to work on this year that you're working on. So we'll, we'll have you back on soon to talk about your legislation. I'd love it. That will be great, Brad. Right. Thanks Thank so you, much. Thank you, Representative. And thanks for your leadership for the Black Caucus Gala. Absolutely. Absolutely. Thank, Thank you. That's all the time we have for this interview. For more great interviews like this one, make sure you hit us up on our social media. And for now, thanks for tuning in.